I applied to the Environment Management and Sustainability Scheme because after doing some research on what JBA does specifically, um, I was really excited about the nature-based solutions work they do in the natural capital work as well. I was attracted to this scheme because uh, it seemed like it was going to be a really supportive atmosphere with lots of mentoring and that really appealed to me. I really like learning new things and being challenged so I've really enjoyed the, the, the work that I've been doing in the environment team has really been pushing me. I work on quite a lot of different projects but at the moment I've been writing natural capital baselines for environmental reports. I do a lot of spatial analysis on GIS, working with really big data sets. Uh, I've been writing some stakeholder engagement plans for work with the Environment Agency and I do a lot of um, work researching local and national policy as well. I have been helped to develop through training with QGIS. It's something that I had a little bit of experience in before I started here, but it's been quite an important part of my work. So I've had a lot of training on that. And I've actually been lucky enough to be able to share that with other people as well. And I also uh, undertook quite a lot of training before I started my rotation to the environment team. And I had a lot of support from my manager in getting, getting the skills that I needed to start on my rotation in the environment team. I would say that you should do some research on all the different work JBA is involved in. We do a massive range of uh, disciplines and it's never too early to start thinking about what you might want to rotate into.